Yeah, it's like, uh, Memphis, fell in love instant. Can't nobody stop it cause the swag is so relentless. Everybody here they got a job or two. If it's beef, then you'll get cooked like a barbecue. You better get on your J-O-B, ain't no F-R-E-E. -E. We grit and grind in every melody, so we just D-I-Y. That's how we got so fly. Hey man, we bad as Bebe's kids and we don't, we don't die. Yo, what up, what up, what up? It is the president of Drippin' Tight Tea, and you are watching Hear It From Here, live from Memphis, Tennessee, brought to you by Kit Kat and Breaker. We are at the home of the Memphis Music Initiative, where we work with young people all across the city to provide accessible music instruction, music engagement, creative writing, and also creative liberation work. So this is kind of the hub of everything. My name is Kirby, and I am from Memphis, Tennessee. Born in Memphis, raised in Mississippi, so that makes me extra spicy, extra country. <laughs> I feel like people have a hard time kind of trying to describe what your soul is, but really I feel like soul is being able to hear your ancestors sing through you. My name's Tyke T. I'm a hip-hop artist, songwriter, and a label owner based here in Memphis, Tennessee. Some of the greatest songs in the world were created here. You can't even measure the significance that Memphis has on the, the past, the present, or the future of music. In Memphis, they S-A-N-G, they sang. It's, it's in their blood, it's the dirt, it's the soul, it's the root, and you gonna feel that today. I seen your story when you was dropping like a song today. Okay. Like it was crazy, because yeah. it inspired me so much. But like, I don't know the beginning, so like what got you into music? I, I grew up on Memphis music. My daddy loves blues, so I grew up, you know, singing uh, Johnny Taylor and Al Green, and, and I think the the commonality, the common thread in all of those artists is soul. You have to indoctrinate the kids to know you are from some place that is legendary. Right. And just by a byproduct of you being from here, right. there's something in you. When you get here and you feel the hustle, that bleeds into the music, and you can't substitute that part. Yeah, cause like these people from the street, so they gonna put that in their music. They gonna put what they know. Those are their experiences. I love this shit with everything because I wouldn't be here today without Memphis. I just wouldn't. And, yeah. and I feel like when you have these programs that expose kids to their alternative routes, for you, a glimmer that shows you, okay, there's there's a way. It's like we're right. trying to create generational wealth. This is a very special place. I know y'all know our young people are creative geniuses. Right. Like, they come from a legacy of creative genius. It is inside of them, right? But they just need places and spaces to be free to let it off. Yeah. It's been great to have a downtown presence so close to Beale Street, right. just a block away. Right. So we want them to feel that connection. They're gonna use their creativity to push us forward. They're gonna use their creativity to create and imagine a more just Memphis. They've got two amazing musicians and Ty Boylan, who's an amazing producer. So he's gonna be with us as we jam a little bit with the young people. And that, that's a huge opportunity for them. So I know they're gonna wanna show you what they have. We have some superstars, some Memphis stars in the house and to share what they know. And I wanted you all to share what you're thinking about as young creatives in Memphis. You're gonna have hurdles. Everybody gonna tell you what you cannot that's do. That's right. just what's gonna happen. That's life. That but are you going to continue to fight through it? Everything that you can ever dream of is gonna come. But with the purpose, you gotta have a message. What is your message in your music? What you have in your hand, in your mind is enough. It really, really, really is enough. Personally, yeah. Memphis is like, it's in my soul, it's my heartbeat. And it's kind of hard because when, when you watch the news, you see so much negativity surrounding Memphis, especially people who don't live in Memphis. And like programs show you the special things about Memphis. Yeah. It's time to actually make some music, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> so, so the track that we have, y'all, some of the elements that really make up Memphis, right? And you know, we're all individuals, so let's put our individual sauce on this, on this barbecue. Mm. All right? Take me back to Memphis. Get excited, though. Hey, 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 hey. Take me back to Memphis. Oh, 
So the only thing that I'll challenge you to do is just ask yourself in your mind, just think about what does Memphis mean to you? When I was younger, they told me it'd be easy to just give it up. Nah, and now we won't give up. Uh uh, you know we won't give up. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Too many doors that you can't see, you can't wait for them to open up. Yeah. Come on, let's go. They didn't believe, but this is my dream. Just what you gon' see. Yeah. Hey, baby, you gon' see. Uh huh. Hey, baby, you gon' see. Let's go. Style yo straight, undeniable. Fire flow, black urban, ungentrifiable. I'm just saying, I'm leaving them with a numb brain. Show respect, could get checked. What's up, man? Nah, bro, I'm just here to let them all know. I got soul running deeper than them potholes. It's a scene where you can't relax. So if I ever leave, better take me back. Soul music is supposed to bring people together. It's important as an artist to be cognizant of the power of what soul can do in that regard. I was gonna tell you what you can't do Cause they couldn't see past their own blood Take me back